So the bottom line, Dr. Robinson says, is act like you've been here before. Joining me now is Mike Cuno and Mike. All right, we saw what the Heat did to the Nuggets in yeah. Game Two. They harassed him on defense. They had a lot of wide open shots on offense. What do you expect the Nuggets to do to adjust? Really, one of the biggest things offensively for Miami was they finally started knocking down their threes. They ended up hitting 17 in that game. The Nuggets, they have the guys to play better perimeter defense. I think they got to chase Miami off the three-point line. Yeah, we're all expecting that Jimmy Butler will have a breakout game yeah. offensively, but he says. He is, quote, not really a scorer, but we've seen him be a scorer. Do you think it's time that Jimmy breaks out in a big way? I think from series to series it changes. What you need Jimmy to be is your closer, certainly, in the fourth quarter. Yeah. If he can just be steady for most of the game, give you good defensive minutes for the first three quarters and come in and seal the deal. Last game he ends up with more than 20 points, kind of came in a flurry there towards the end of the fourth quarter. I think that's the Jimmy you kind of need in the series. All right. Who are you picking to be the X factor tonight? The X factor. It has to be Bam. Bam has to be the guy all series long. He's going to be the X factor. He's been the X Factor for Miami since game one in this series. For them to win, he's got to have continue to have big games. I'm going to pick Kyle Lowry off the bench because I think he is about due. You know, he's got that smarts and the savvy, and it's really important that the Heat bench play well. Lowry has been up yeah. and down, so I think if he can have a solid night, then that uh, pretends well for the Heat. And, of course, Mike, we know a lot of celebs are going to be in the house. I wonder if Messi's going to jet over here tonight and check out the game. Well, I'm sure he can afford courtside seats here now <laughs> with the amount of money he's probably getting to come play for Inter Miami. He can afford to buy the arena for that matter. He can call yeah. it the Messi Center. <laughs> <laughs> Careful, he might. I know. All right, that's the story here at the Caseya Center. Along with Mike Cunio, I'm Jim Barry. Back to you. Who knows? Messi might show up. All these big sports <laughs> stories we have lately, nothing surprises us. I know.